Hi Gemini, Aditi here with Lodestone Productions where we help you discover your true north. Okay, welcome to your spread for February. As always, we have the overall energies here, past, present, and future energies here, clarifiers for each and final words and or summary from spirit. So, let's, uh, hold on. Okay, let's get this party started. So, overall energy is Anka, kin of the Red Hawk tribe. And it reads, Anka. On the wings of the red-tailed hawk, a divine message comes. Your spiritual maturity has evolved into genuine power and discernment. You have earned your stripes. Acknowledgement is granted. Trust yourself in your destiny. You are ready. Trust in your sense of timing, which is excellent and inspired. Allow the divine to support you as you hover until the moment comes for you to fearlessly plunge into your forthcoming adventure. Anka. So you got a bonus for your past cards. You've got the Queen of Pentacles and the Seven of Pentacles. Present energy is the Two of Swords and future energy is the Queen of Wands. So either... Queen of Pentacles, Seven of Cups, you so you've got a tried and true way of handling your resources and now you've been faced with new ways to be able to manage them. You've been presented with several opportunities. I'm hearing multiple income streams, multiple income streams. And with the Two of Swords here, you feel like there's not enough information to make a decision. And with the Queen of Wands, you want to feel good about the choice that you're making. You know, you, you're, it, it seems as though you are relying on your intuition to tell you where to go with this seven of cups so to clarify queen of cups uh, yeah no queen of pentacles and the seven of cups you got the eight of cups the two of wands and the knight of cups so yes You know that something is going to have, you're going to have to walk away from something. In order to go on this new path, right? And you're, you're full of, yes, let's go, let's go. But to where? It's kind of like the, it's almost like a hurry up and wait 
kind of situation. I think you want to be certain that the path that you take is going to be the most beneficial. And to clarify the Two of Swords, you've got to clarify the Two of Swords, you've got the Lovers, Strength card, and the Five of Wands. Yep. Let's go ahead and so you want to make sure with this Knight of Wands that it's actually right before you make your final decision, Lover's card, because you know that there's, it's going to, yes, it's going to take strength, but we know that the strength card is more about balancing action versus inaction. And the... Yes, you can have brute strength, but it makes no sense if there's no finesse to go along with that. So with the strength card, it's about tampering the finesse because you're going to be willing to defend your decision. You know you'll have to be ready to defend your decision once you've made it. Clarifying the king, not king, clarifying the queen of wands, we have the ace of swords, judgments, and the queen of pentacles. Yeah, you, you know. You know. With the Ace of Wands, like it is perfect. It is it is very clear to you that you're going to have to make a decision which has a level of finality with it in order to protect the resources that you have amassed thus far and also to have them to grow. So if we're talking, you know, in a very practical sense, like you know that you have to spend money to make money, but the question is, are, are you going to spend it wisely? Because you want to feel good about your cash flow, right? So... Final messages from Spirit are Queen of Wands, Nine of Swords, Four of Cups, and Queen of Pentacles. I, yeah. Your main concern is making sure that your decision is fair, but more importantly, that it's fair to you. Because you know somebody is gonna get hurt. And you, you wanna make sure that the injured party is not yourself. It's a reminder to stay connected to Source and listen to what they have to tell you because there will be divine assistance as you go through with this because queen of pentacles this this level of living is what you've been working for and you do indeed deserve to have it okay gemini thank you for spending some time with me today and until we meet again be good to yourselves and to each other and I will see you all next time bye now